video, we are going to be touring the Fancy. The Fancy is out here at Wayne Fire Homes in Albany, Georgia. The Fancy is a four bedroom, three bath home. Sorry, I had to check my paper. It's a four bedroom, three bath home. We don't have furniture or anything, but you know what? We don't even need it. Let's get into it. All right, you guys, this is the Fancy. The Fancy is just what it says. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a little tight on the back, so we won't walk around, but I wanted to show you the exterior of the Fancy. Absolutely love it, and I can't wait for you to see what it looks like. So let's get into it. Okay, okay, so again, this home isn't furnished. Shut the door, hopefully it's not too dark. This home isn't furnished. Absolutely beautiful though. This is your living room. They got transom windows in here, you guys. Nice and bright, large space, this living room. Maybe you can't tell because it doesn't have furniture, but this is a nice space for your living room. So. Just imagine how you would decorate. I would probably put my couch or my sectional on this side and have my TV mounted on that wall. Or you can turn everything to face this way and have your, your TV in front of the window. Or you can have it cat a corner in that corner right there. It's always nice to mount a TV on that corner and put it on a swivel so you can turn your furniture different ways. But this is a living room, really lovely. And then you can see straight into the dining room area. You have your nice sliders here. You have all the space here for your dining room table. And you even have a buffet area over here with lots of cabinet space up and down. So you have Cabinets there, cabinets up here. And if I can reach it, oh, you have additional cabinets up there and just a little space over the top for like decor. Maybe run some plants or something, but really nice. This will make a nice area if you have, like if you're serving a dinner, you can put food here or on a daily basis, it could be your drink or coffee station, really love And you have all this area for dining room, so you can put a nice big table here, and you have plenty of space that leads out to your big, beautiful deck outside the sliding glass, so really lovely. And then next to it, you have your kitchen. Huge, huge, huge island, butcher block island. You got your sink in the island, but you still have so much space, even if someone was sitting here, they have, have all of the space and they're not interrupted by you cooking, chopping vegetables, washing dishes, what have you. You can put two to three bar stools here and two to three bar stools here, depending on the size of the bar stool, which is a plus. Absolutely love this island. Love all, all of this counter and cabinet space. You have upper cabinets, and then you have that third, that second tier of cabinets above that over every upper cabinet. So really nice. You have a drawer for every lower cabinet, which is always a plus. And you have cabinet space in this island. Now, the island is a pretty silvery gray. I don't know if you can tell on camera. But this is a pretty silvery gray, and then this is white. So a really nice contrast here and lots of counter space, which is always a plus. This model has stainless steel appliances, and you got two big windows in here. You also have across from the refrigerator that has lots of cabinet space in itself, but you also have your butler's pantry. 
So that is a nice plus. You have a family room through there. We'll see that in a minute. But you got this butler pantry, pantry area. Absolutely wonderful. I didn't check the lights in this area. But we'll see if the lights are on. So we can make it a little brighter. If I can find the lights. <laughs> Let's see. I don't think so. No, no lights in here. So you got your butler pantry over there. And then on this side, you have your laundry room. So we'll check out the laundry room. This laundry room does have a door that closes, which is nice. You've got a dedicated space right here at the door for a refrigerator, or excuse me, a deep freezer. You got all of this counter space, two levels for storage, for folding clothes. You've got outlets if you want to iron over there. Your washer and dryer go here. More cabinet and um, space up there, really nice. And this laundry room has a window that opens. So all beautiful features, lots of space in here. And you may not have a deep freezer. You can put, you can put uh, storage here for your appliances or what have you. So really nice, really lovely. Beautiful, beautiful home. Gonna give you another spin here. And then we'll go check out the additional bedrooms. Really nice. All right, so down this hall, past the kitchen, you've got your additional bedroom here. Nice size bedroom. Really nice. You got a standard closet in this room. Perfect. And then you've got a connecting bathroom, Jack and Jill bathroom, for this room and the room next door. So you've got a sink here to the right. Sorry, so. And I don't have my light. You have a sink here to the right. And then you have your toilet and shower area over here. Really nice. So again, this is your sink area with mirror. You got some pretty wallpaper here. And then in here, you've got a nice shower with a step stool and your toilet. I hope that light is helping. Okay, really nice. So it's the first additional bedroom and you've got a connecting bathroom. All right, and then right here, you have a coat closet. So your guests can hang their coats so you can store whatever items you like in there, right off the kitchen. The kitchen is here and your coat closet is here. And then we just saw this bedroom. So now we're gonna check out the adjoining bedroom. Seems to be the same size, another nice size bedroom. Standard closet in this one as well. Really nice. So there's your closet. And then this is the entrance into that bathroom that we just saw. So really lovely. Perfect. Now down on this side of the house, these bedrooms are off this family room. And this family room was the room that connected to the butler's pantry. So you can get directly into the kitchen that way, or you can go down the hall. You can also close this off. If you don't like the barn door, you could do a different type door there but you do have the ability if the kids are making too much noise to kind of close them off from the rest of the company. But this is a nice size family room. We make a nice 
man cave for my husband if we lived here. Really nice. And then this is the third additional bedroom. Another nice size bedroom. Possibly the same size as the first ones we saw. Really nice. And you got another standard closet. So that's awesome. Love it. And then your guest bath is right here. So you have a bath here that also has a tub and shower combo. So you have three full baths in here. Really nice. Three full baths and you have a side door here. So if you want to do a carport, you have a side door that walks into the family room as well as sliding glass doors off the kitchen. So really lovely. Again, this is the fancy. It's a four bedroom, three bath. And the only room left to see is the primary. So let's take a look. So the primary is the only bedroom that doesn't have carpet. I guess if you ordered this home, you could specify whether you wanted carpet in here or whether you wanted carpet in the other rooms as well. You could get the entire house with no carpet if you choose, or you can get the entire house with carpet. It's really up to your preference. Lots of ceiling fans in this house too, you guys. We've counted a ceiling fan in the living room, the family room, and in, and in here. So really nice. You've got a huge walk-in closet in the primary, which is always a plus. You got that built-in shelving there. I would bring shelving around on this wall though. And you've got all of that over there. So just to give you an idea, I'll look at the floor. This is a really big space and you could absolutely add to it. You could also put like a dressing table or a makeup table here and then have this space. But I would either put another shelf this way or run an additional one halfway down. So really nice. All right, that's your primary closet. And then next to your primary closet is the primary bathroom. You got your double sinks with cabinets and drawer space over there. You got this huge walk-in shower, really nice, with the with the uh, rain shower shower head. You got your toilet and tub in here. Lots of storage in this area, and you got a transom window. Really lovely, really nice. Love the touch they gave with the hooks over here on the walls for your towels and bathrobes and things. Super nice, really lovely. All right, again, this is the fancy, you guys. This is the fancy, and this home is fancy. Love it, well put together. If you're interested and you live in Albany, Georgia, or near Albany, Georgia, come on down to Wayne Fire Homes and uh, take a look at the homes on their property. It's a huge property with lots of homes, and they've done a really good job. They were very intentional with the homes that they chose and the features that they have in the home. And listen, if you mention that you saw this home lot on this channel on Homes and Things by Christy, and you decide to purchase, you get a free furniture package. All right? So tell those folks that Christy from Homes and Things sent you down here. All right. See you in the next video.